platform is traveling at the same speed as your time machine vehicles. Please take small children by the hand, look down, and watch your step onto the platform. AT&T welcomes you aboard Spaceship Earth. Journey with us now to the dawn of recorded time as we explore the amazing story of human communication. We claim the state of Like a grand and miraculous spaceship, our planet has sailed through the universe of time. And for a brief moment, we have been among its many passengers. From the very beginning, we have always sought to reach out to one another, to bridge the gaps between us, to communicate. Across a lonely, hostile planet, our early ancestors spread out in search of food shelter. With the development of language came a vital key to our survival. For the first time, we could share and learn from one another. We bonded together in small tribes and prospered. No longer isolated. No longer alone. Ages later, the Egyptians invented the first written communications, a complex language of hieroglyphic pictures and symbols. With the creation of papyrus scrolls came the world's first piece of paper. Now, without ever leaving their palaces, pharaohs could deliver proclamations and decrees to subjects across the land. Phoenician merchants established the earliest commercial highways, trading goods and information at distant parts of Kor. They created the first common alphabet and shared this new tool across the Mediterranean. In ancient Greece, the spoken word was elevated to a fine art. Philosophers debated with one another in plazas, and storytellers found a new form for personal expression. The theater was born. <laughs> The Roman Empire bridged three continents with a vast system of roads. The fastest information highways the world had ever known. 
East, west, north and south, all roads led to Rome. These same roads were turned against Rome by invaders whose destruction left ages of knowledge and wisdom in the ashes that would become the Dark Ages. But all was not lost, for far across the land, from Cairo to Cordoba, Jewish teachers and Islamic scholars continued the quest for knowledge. In libraries of wisdom, they debated ideas and shared new discoveries with all who would listen. Western abbeys, monks toiled endlessly in lonely isolation, copying ancient books of wisdom and revelations for future generations. Finally, from the depths of the Dark Ages, came the Age of Enlightenment, the Renaissance. And with this era came a powerful new invention, the movable type printing press. Scientists, explorers and scholars spread their discoveries in books and essays. Poets, musicians and artists, fueled by the passion of the age, created timeless works of beauty and majesty. wave of inspiration, we sailed into a bold new era of communication, bringing an explosion of tools and technologies which would bridge people around the world as never before. And as our appetite for information and knowledge grew, the world began to shrink. Today, we possess the ability to connect with one another instantly, anywhere on the planet. Teresa, do you want to see my team's winning run? Cool, launch it over. Okay, I you. Excellent. I knew you were a star. I'm just 
Mr. The Jump Rope. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Get down. It won the match. And you got me bowing now, too. So Nanda, so the Shia ni katanda yo. Boku mo ojigi shite ru yo. Terry san, you are one cool dude. Terry san, you are one cool dude no A new communication super network is being built before our eyes. Spaceship Earth glows with billions of interactions, carrying news and information at the very speed of light. But will these seemingly infinite communications become a flood of electronic babble, or will we use this power to usher in a new age of understanding and cooperation on this, our Spaceship Earth? Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Zywink. You have beautiful, healthy baby twins on the way. When will they be here? Well, let me take a look. I think you only have to wait another three more months. What do you see, Doctor? From the hologram, it looks like a full mandible. You should see it for real, Miguel. It's unbelievably complete. It is. Except for this. How'd you like to get bit by a set of these babies? The cranial structure is the most perfect. Sí, sí, es increíble. Felicidades, Eduardo. Great, Eddie. It's more than we ever hoped for.
Since the dawn of recorded time, communication has revolutionized our lives and changed our world. We now have the ability and the responsibility to build new bridges of acceptance and cooperation between us, to create a better world for ourselves and our children as we continue our amazing journey aboard Spaceship Earth. AT&T thanks you for traveling with us. At AT&T, we are dedicated to bringing people together, providing you with easy access to each other and the information you want and need anytime and anywhere. We now invite you to sample the future of communication in AT&T's global neighborhood. Gentlemen, boys and girls, you are approaching the new global neighborhood. Now that you've seen the future, we invite you to experience it yourself. Soon your vehicle doors will open automatically. Please gather your belongings and watch your step on the moving platform. Then walk through the portal to AT&T's new global neighborhood and a whole new way to communicate. Come on, I'll meet you there.
Thank <laughs> you.